Hey everybody, it's uh, me again. I just wanted your opinions on something. Um, Nick Carter's CD I'm taking off is being released in Japan and through his uh, website. Uh, Japan, the cheapest I can get it, uh, total would be $49. And that's with 12 tracks and a bonus DVD. Now, there is software out there to play that DVD in U.S. laptops, so there's not an issue there. His website is selling it to all U.S. residents that want it for a total of like $33. So, uh, so you might be saying, well, that's a $15 difference, so why buy the one that costs more? Hear me out. Um... One of the added appeals of the online oh, uh, on his website's version is he autographed it. Um, that doesn't sell me on it. Uh, I already have two of his autographs that I got personally from him. Um, sure, I would like another one, but it's not selling me on it, and it's not the version that I want. Um, you know, brand new DVDs at the lowest will cost nine ninety nine. So getting a brand new DVD and a one extra song for about fifteen dollars, don't you think that's kind of worth it? Would you do it? Um, and once again, 49 versus 33. Um, if it's like your favorite musical person and you want that DVD and you know you can play that DVD and it comes with an extra song, wouldn't you do it? I mean, $15 is the cost of a DVD pretty much anywhere. What do you guys think? Let me know. Peace. Bye.